a light sex toy. Oh my god, he said it with the strange American accent. It's Australian! <laughs> Welcome to another week of John and Daniel vlogs. I've never seen a poo, so, honestly, ever seen a poo so big as what Jack just did. I'm not going to show you shit, you know, because it's not very nice. But it was like a really big one and then another really big one, and it was wide. It was really big, so I kind of had to struggle getting my hand in the. No, it doesn't. I didn't. I just. <laughs> I got it all in one bag without getting it on my fingers. Oh, he hello, hello. And I've got to get Sunny this morning because I'm picking him up more early. So he doesn't destroy anything. And I've just opened the door in Davonola's flats, but I didn't look inside, so I don't know if he's done any damage, but it's only been an hour since they've left. Oh, right, okay, let me get my shite together, so to speak. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's half past eight, you know. I don't know how long they've been out, but he's, oh my God. I only came back into, What a mess. This is so bad. You know, he's gonna have to start coming up. I mean, let Dama or whoever goes to work last, they're gonna have to bring him upstairs. Otherwise, you know, things, everything's gonna get destroyed. I think it's because he's at that age, you know? And um, I'm gonna say, and not, not like you know, but you might know. He's waiting to have his balls cut. And I think that might have something to do with it. All right, guys, I'm gonna do a, just a rough pick at the majority of. Daniel was so pissed last time. He was so, so pissed. He can't even remember coming back. He, he couldn't speak. He, could do, he was walking up. And I just like put him on the sofa. Daniel. Um, I was just thinking. So, yeah. Are you gonna have a good day at work today? Morning, morning, bright and breezy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why, why, why you happy, happy, that? happy, happy, happy. Why, why you have that hand? Are you thinking I'm gonna hit you? <laughs> Shit! I was just. Oh my god, my eyeball. Seriously. Ugh. I don't know if I've got. Oh, sorry, Sunny. Um, I don't know if it's because of the screen or what it is, but. I need to stop for half an hour. I might go and lie down in the dark room, in a dark room. But I think it's looking at the screen. I think that's what it is. But I've got shit to do. But yeah, that's fine, John. Have a break for an hour, an hour or two. Get back on it. A friend of mine, Sam, came round today and I haven't seen her for such a long time. And she says, are you vlogging? And I was like, no. So instead, I'm gonna put her on the vlog a picture in preparation. This is a portrait what I did of her. Hello, John. Oh, I'm really happy to be in your vlog. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Jason, what is your problem? Shut the fuck up. Eat your food quite Jason, what's wrong with your hair? My hair? Lisa, <laughs> what happened? How did, how did you break your head? Oh, poor safe. Uh, yes, poor safe. Look My how head. sharp they is. Is it pretty? <laughs> oh, yeah. You're gonna die soon. Oh, oh. Poor Larissa. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're saying, I'm Ma breaking the safe. <laughs> Man, on Daniel's flip flops. You know, I buy these flip flops. I buy flip flops and spat chips out. Chips. Crisps. I'm not even American and I say chips because. I think we're watching all these YouTube videos and TikTok videos intercontinental. So kind of like certain words are becoming more, I don't know, more at the front of my mind to use, which is peculiar. But this is the world we're living in and that's a good thing. So we spread the love, spread the language and hopefully not spread anything else apart from that. All the good stuff, let's say. I'm gonna go to bed. Look, I'm just talking a lot of shit. 
you seen this Vasos water or Voss water? This is a plastic bottle, but I'm gonna tell you this. I know that Kim Kardashian drinks that water, even though this is tap water, because I'm as glamorous as she is. I've got Voss, Voss water. I'm going downstairs just a little bit earlier because what we've got to do is check on Sunny to make sure that there's no destruction there might be so we found out Dalma and Olaf were not impressed but I didn't tell them until they got back but you don't want to say you know your house is destroyed um, in the morning because then it leaves you to worry about it all day let's have a look inside come on is it going to be destroyed oh, ow is it going to be destroyed oh <gasps> I would not want to be in Sonny's position when Dalma gets home. Um, is yours not ready? Huh? Is yours not ready? It is ready. Oh my god, Daniel, how much did you make? Well, he did the right thing, he kind of had a small plate. But you, you, you will eat throughout the day, I know you. It's true, I will. God, man, I am a bit hungry. I'm really busy today. So many emails, I've got like oh, 180 tasks. My um, database nightmare. We have a break. I've done. Daniel's off to work. He, he, he cheats at work. He every time I leave, he finishes work. And I no, know because of another eight hours, and then he's like, "Oh yeah, I'm tired. It's too close. Oh, and that's it. His day is done. Now I'm gonna have to work until midnight. And if I wake up late, he's like, "Daniel, you said you're gonna wake up at ten. Anyway, good night. He's a wanker. Yeah, listen, he's got a lot of shit. Look, it's three o'clock now, and I'm gonna do the vlog tomorrow until, um, I mean, if they come in the morning, then I'll have a look at that, but I, I really wanna get some wallpaper on. Look at this! I put bleach on the wall, and there's no more writing on the wall. I really like that writing oh, reminded me that I, I can't write in, like. Oh, oh yeah, because he. <laughs> but anyway, please switch off the computer. Uh, I will do. Yeah, but it's gone, so I'm, I'm going to paint. I need to go out, check out the side and then start painting. Have a look if you've got any wood paint. If not, buy some wood paint and all that shit. All that shit. Turn off, bitch. Thank you. Oh my God. I'm changing my diet today. I'm going to have sushi. Yeah. All right, this is our best customer that sex stories. <laughs> best the best customer ever. Ever. It's elite sex toy. Elite sex toy. Oh my god, he said it with a strange American accent. It's Australian. <laughs> So on Facebook, I'm part of this group, which is Bailey Caravans, which happens to be the make which I have, because that would be really stupid if I just followed any caravan, unless I just like caravans in general, which I do, but I do like mine, and I like to know about my type of caravan. And there's a caravan for sale, the same year, the same spec, everything, for over 2,000 pound more than what I bought my caravan for, four years ago can you believe that i know that when people start getting the caravans when they had enough of them they're going to give them back and then the market's going to be flooded i'm sure that was is what that's what's going to happen but it's quite nice to know that all this money what i'm spending on the caravan at the moment and i am going to spend some more money on it because some some things which are majorly broken like that kitchen window which is cracked and then oh, some of the bits and bobs as well but well, at least I'm spending some money on something which I know is worth a decent amount of money, which is great. Caravanning, caravanning, caravanning. <laughs> Good night. Well, as you can see, all the walls are painted. <laughs> and I'm doing the vlog. I'm just so confused about what's wrong with me. I've just been sat. Here watching you, you know, the um, TV series with the killers on Netflix. And I'm like, I'm not doing anything. I went into, um, I should say, I came into the lounge this morning and it was like no, eight o'clock when I got up. And I'm like, Daniel, it's 10 30. Anyway, it was like, yeah, they do it every fucking time. I think it's now, it's 10 30. The alarm's gone off. I went in at 10 15 trying to wake him up. He didn't get up. I'm not going to wake him up. Fuck yourself. 
because if he's screaming at me not getting up when I'm telling him to, he can be late for work. I'm sorry, I tried. But no, no, no. It's evil. I'm not gonna go in there again, I'm sorry. No, I'm not. I heard him slang off as well and he ignored it. Baby, are you late for work? Are you late for work? Yeah, can you drive me? No fucking way. Daniel leaving. Oh, what a great day not to do anything today. Yeah, I think he knows me better than I know myself. He could see my face. It was like, I just don't want to do anything. You know, at some point, I just think you need a day to recoup because I've worked. I've worked six days and I need a day to recoup. So I'm kind of pushing myself to do this and that and the other. And I'm just not gonna now. So I bought all that crap in the co-op, which was fucking disgusting, but I'm gonna really enjoy it. Sugar, sugar, sugar. Well, that just happened. That's disgusting. I feel disgusting. <laughs> Sugar rush, head's hurting. I need some paracetamol. I'm gonna have to lay down. Then I'm just gonna fuck it all on your paracetamol. There's one paracetamol. <sighs> Why did I do that? I can't even get it open. Oh God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and lie down for a minute. Ow, my head. I need water. I need. Lots of poetry tomorrow. I'm gonna lay down. Ow, my head! Why do people do that? No. There's a bin, like, just. I'm gonna sit there, that's fine. But just throw it in the goddamn recycling bin. Ah. So I don't have to do it. <sighs> can't believe. I actually can't believe. I just slept all the way through. I started putting on, um, don't know if I told you, put on Squid Game. And I was like, tired. Don't wanna watch this bed. Sick after the cake, and then done. That's it all the way through until eight o'clock this morning on Sunday, but at least I feel fresh now. I feel like I want to do stuff and don't feel like I want the day off or I don't want to do anything. So what to do? I think tidy up first and then have a look for some paint. I haven't cleaned this fish out in a while, so I'm going to just do that first thing. Um, I've got to be careful though, because there's so many fish. When I go sucky sucky and take some of the water out, you know, you've got to be so careful because I might suck up a fish or some of the fish. Right, let me get all my bits together. I'm going to do this like steadily so I don't kill any, even though, you know, I could do with getting rid of a few, but I'm not going to kill them. I'm not a milk of her. I don't know how long that fish has been in there. I mean, the last time I cleaned it out was a long time. It was like two weeks. So it might have been in there two weeks, you know, who knows? come up through the bottom and just living in there. Right, I'm gonna clean all these filters now. How, how, how are you gonna hurt me, baby? Ooh, can't find a paint anywhere. I mean, I did find a little bit, but it's certainly not enough to do this. So I think I'm gonna have to pop over to the shop. Um, actually, I'm gonna go downstairs first. And then I'm gonna have to take a drive, I think, by the looks of things, which is a bit of a pain. Can't do anything with that paint, and I can't even find white paint either. Um, I'm gonna go downstairs and have a look first. Can't find any paint, and you know what? Actually, you know, I think there's a place in Battersea that might be open. I think, um, you know, like not being q the other one, there's being q and there's home base. I think there's one in Battersea, I'm gonna check. And I'm just gonna have to pop into there. And, I can't find the tray, you know, the tray with the roller and all that stuff. <sighs> We've got too much crap, I can't find anything. Who was drunk last night? Okay. You were. No, I wasn't. He couldn't even, he said, oh, I can't remember you speaking with me. I said, you were so pissed. He kept saying, I'm not, wasn't drunk. So annoying, he was slurring. I said, Daniel, what have you been drinking? He's like, I'm not drunk. He's so unappreciative. I've never known anybody just criticize, have a little giddy dig, like, why is it such a mess? You're not fucking funny, Daniel. I'm trying to paint our flat for us. It's not for me, it's for us. 
and he wouldn't say anything like well done or great or anything like that. He just makes me feel like a wanker. And then Todd, he asked me to t he asked me to take him to work because he got pissed last night, he didn't get up on time. And I'm like explaining to him, I said, not nice, you know. Oh, let's see where this cyclist is going now. It's not nice. Okay. If you don't, just say at least thank you, or can I help, or is there anything you need, or anything like that. Oh god, I hate him sometimes. I hate him. I really, I really think there's a problem with the start, you know, because I was trying to get gloss rollers. This is for an outdoor fence, but I thought I'm going to get a little kit anyway because it'll make it easy for me to do. Um, I'm going to have a look around to see what other crap I can possibly buy and waste my money on. Ooh, plants. No plants. No plants. I would just, as I do, I change the woman and being um, home base. And um, I said, oh, it's my day off. I'm going to stop painting now. I really don't want to. I said, well, I don't have kids, you know, so I slept all day yesterday. And she said, oh, I'm praying for you to have some children. I'm like, do not, do not pray for me to have any kids because I ain't gonna happen. No way, I don't want kids at all. I did, I did try, you know, I tried with a friend of mine, um, a lesbian friend of mine for a whole year. And um, at the end of the year, I mean, she was going around to my place, I was going around to her place. And I mean, you're not gonna ask me the logistics of it or how we actually tried to do it. Well, maybe you will. If you want to know, you can ask me privately, I'll tell you. Um, but it didn't happen. So I decided, well, that's it now. Just concentrate on myself, on my business. And I'm like, you know, my brothers have kids. Why do I need more kids? So many kids in the foster system, being adopted, no more kids. Do you want a special treat? Got a special treat for you. <laughs> Daniel bought this bag of bones, like lamb bones. So they're, they're not cut. I don't even know how big it is. Oh God, hang on, try to do this. I don't know where you got them from. <laughs> Good girl. I'll keep you occupied while I'm doing my stuff. And I don't want you climbing on the bed and eating that. No, 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 not on the bed. Good girl, anyway around here. I just gave um, all the wood in this room a coat. It's still a bit wet, but it looks like it hasn't taken that well. But, okay, but look at this door. This door looks white, you know, there's no, and it was used with, the, I used the um, roller. So there's less paint on this, but it looks more even. But maybe it's because the door is a bit flat, but look at this, look at this mess. I can't get it off. It's so tacky. This wood paint, this wood and metal paint, is not coming off easy. I got most of it off my hands, but now I've got a few hours, like two and a half hours, to do the white walls. Got to do it now. I've got to go. Leave me alone. I don't have time. No light. I mean, you're not going to be able to tell any difference. And to be honest with you, I can't even tell any difference. I mean, the woodwork, okay, it is whiter. Oh, by the way, that woodwork, I'm sure it's gloss. I'm sure it's, I can't get it off any of the glass stuff. And then, you know, you should be able to read it and it usually says a, like plastic base or water base. Anyway, it says, clean this brush with this brush cleaner. And I'm thinking, that's gloss. Otherwise they would not have put a specific brush cleaner on there. Cause usually you can just do it with water and wash up liquid. Anyway, a lot is done. I've got paint all over the floors. You can see my fat belly there with some paint on it. And, um, I'm just gonna keep cracking on. I just have to clean now. <sighs> this is not the nicest thing to do, but I've had to do this on all of this wall because I actually built this wall, it's fake. And I did it because I want, oh, for fuck's sake. Because I, I wanted a kind of central piece because this, um, this room's just square. But I'm having to take off all these little pieces of wallpaper and carefully cut down and strip them off if I can. And it's taking me an age. Horrible job, horrible job. But look, I've done, I've, only, I've done most of it. I've got a little bit here down there to do and a little bit on the other side. I think I'm gonna have to leave it for tonight. I, I can't do much more. 
you know, I'll rub it down and then it's gonna be ready for my new paper. I'm so excited about my paper. And if it looks good, did I tell you what it is? Well, I'm not gonna tell you what it is. I might have already done it. Well, if I have, I'm not gonna tell you again. <laughs> but it's coming in a few days time. I'm hoping to get it on before I go to the caravan on Friday with, do you wanna build a snowman? I'll laugh. You know, I don't even think the fish type, the fish shop, don't lick me, baby. I don't even think, good back. I don't even think the fish shop, the, you know, the pet store, I'm gonna take them until they're a lot certain size. Uh, like, um, I don't know, until you can tell whether they're male or female at least. Ooh. Maybe you should just say, can I give you like a spoonful? You know, like just get them out with a net and say, you sort them out. I'm gonna ask them, you know, if they take them, because it's just not fair, and I don't even want any money for them, I just want them gone. It's too much. I just jumped in the bath, I think I got most of the paint off. And I've still got bits on me. <laughs> I sent a message to Daniel because I've left the kitchen in the right mess. I've left one tray with wallpaper, wall, wall painting, and water to kind of soak. And then the other one, I got some um, white spirit from the shop, and that's just soaking, but there's like white spirit plus paint splattered all over the pots. It's a right mess. But, you know, I don't care. I don't care. I'm leaving it until tomorrow. Good night. Sonny is now, or he should be, if he hasn't escaped, in the kitchen. So that should stop him from ripping things up. Let's see. Oh, hello. <laughs> That's better. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> finished half an hour earlier you know I had to get out my eyes are hurting so much I've got a headache behind my eyes so my mum's on the phone and she's saying John you've got to go and get your eyes tested and you know I booked an appointment I just did it I booked it for tomorrow um I could have done it a little bit earlier actually because I've got a meeting just straight after the eye test so hopefully I'll get back in time it's got to be done you know I didn't come out with this ball. I just didn't want to bring any balls at all. I just wanted to sit down the pot while the dogs play with each other. Jack, she goes and finds one. Uh, doesn't she? So we've got a ball now. I think I might go to bed early. And for you, Lar, I think I always say I'm tired. It's true, I do get tired, you know, as old men and old women, just like you. Because I'm not, I'm young and I'm vibrant and fresh. I will be. Do you know what I had today? I had a consultation for my blepharoplasty to remove these sagging eyelids. Look how saggy they are, they're so long. So um, I spoke to him and he said, um, he told me the price, which I'm not going to share with you because every time I repeat it, it scares the shit out of me. I'm in debt, but I'm gonna get some more credit cards because you know my face has got to be good for you guys. It's got to be good. I don't want you looking at this vlog and thinking, I cannot stand that ugly bastard. Turn off. You see, I'm doing it all for you, and I haven't even monetized the channel. <laughs> Maybe I should do that now. I wouldn't do that to you, not yet, anyway. You know, when we start getting like hundreds of thousands of hits, maybe I will. But at the moment, it's all for your pleasure. I'm not going to do anything, but I'm cooking. I'm fatty. Are you ready? I'm sorry, hang on a second. Ooh, thank you. That looks really nice, thank you very much. Burn yourself, please. Oh, that looks lovely. Thank you so much, Daniel. You need to wash the cutlery because it's not clean. What? It's no cutlery clean. Oh. 
Okay, what do you mean I have to wash it? You need to do it. I need to really pull my finger out and start these credit cards with what my eyes doing. I mean, you might not think they're that bad, but they are, you know. So that's my normal lid. They should be up there. What do you think, Jack? You should get your lids done as well. Because she's got droopy eyes. Looks like your droopy eyes. Are they droopy? Droopy eyes. Okay, I'll sleep on it. Come on. I feel like I've got so, so much to do this week. But what about my eye test, you know? I think it's gonna be better long term because if I can get my eyeballs sorted so I don't get headaches, that would be great. Come on, inside. Come on. Jack, inside. <laughs> oh, hello. Yeah, no mess. Brilliant. Daniel's arrived back from the gym. Let's look how you're walking now while you're at the gym. <laughs> Why is it that when you come back from the gym, you always like... Because I feel all pumped up and nice and feeling good and then you put me down straight away. And, but I'm good at that. Yeah, you're good. That's why you're C-U-N-T. I can't spell. Yeah, you can't spell. Do you want some food? Yes. It's so funny walks in like that. Well, it's so look hot, look I haven't put these bags this, down. Look, look. I, I'm working hard. But I don't come back from the gym doing that. You don't go to the gym. Yeah, but I will do and I'm going to. Oh my God, I've just applied for credit cards. I got accepted for them. Totted out my balance transfer. You can do balance transfer and you haven't done it. For God's sake, do it. I should have done it ages ago. Um, but that means that I won't have to pay. I've got, oh sorry, I've got to pay that percentage to move the money over. But long story short, is it'll save. Oh, thank you for the salmon. That's nice, I love salmon. So I'm quite happy, but it also means that I applied for another credit card, which you were really successful with. That means that these drew people, look at that, look at that. That's how my eyes are. It's too much, look. So these are gonna be all gone, make me look fresh. Oh, and... One day you're gonna ask to fucking change your face. If I could change my face, I never would because it's almost perfect. <laughs> yeah, that's why you're changing everything about you. I don't like the way I look, you know, I'm, I'm not exactly changing my face. I'm just putting things back to how they used to be. John, tell everybody that what you want to do when you go to the gym. I'm going to go for a shit. Leave me alone. <laughs> John, oh. tell everybody when you go to the gym. I'm having a shit. Move. Please, Daniel, come on. I think I'm being a good boy by getting my eyes tested. Um, I don't, do I really care if you have to wear glasses? Sort of, because it's a bit of a pain, but I think it's more for reading. I think the only thing we can do though is go and see exactly what they say. Because I know I cannot read small print. I know that my eyes are really struggling. This is my field, I've just been trying on glasses. I have no idea what I'm looking for. And this really kind of assistant is going around and he's running around trying to find the ones that suit me. I'm just gonna leave it to him. So if I look like an idiot in two weeks' time when I get my lenses, it's his fault. Just spent 300 pounds on lenses. That was wrong. On frames <laughs> and lenses. It's buy one, get one free. So I had to get a decent amount because I've got to look good for you, you know? It's gonna look amazing for you. My client just left, and guess what? I is finished. Finished, I'm not working anymore. Then you went to the gym, so you've got to work some more hours. Okay. Feel a bit guilty. Who went not. to the doctors? Who was on the phone? Who did all this stuff that wasn't working? But no, I'm not calculating those. Hey. It is six o'clock, you know? I think I've done pretty well. Oh, by the way, the wallpaper, which was supposed to, which was supposed to arrive today, never got ordered by me. I didn't order it. So now I just spend money on one roll of wallpaper and this wallpaper, all right, the other one was, the other one was 20 quid. This one was 50. John, I'm Actually, still working, so 50, calm down. Listen, I'm talking. 56 including delivery, you're so rude. I don't have a calculator. I don't care. 
Um, yeah, so you still look amazing. Oh, I'm gonna have to go because Daniel needs the phone to calculate stuff because it's a bit thick. Okay, Daniel, come on, tell me, what is it? Three plus two is. How much is three plus two? Again? 17. Are you close? Have you seen his belly? <laughs> Get off me. <laughs> it's 10 o'clock in the evening and I'm still doing stuff. I've been working until now because covering my hours for going to the gym early today. And I made my favorite set yogurt. I love it. Anywho, I'm gonna clean up my mess and I'm gonna go to bed. Good night. So annoying. I was told to call up Hall um, Virgin about the credit cards this morning because stupid me, I made a mistake. I actually have paid, or um, put down to pay over a thousand pound extra. This is the um, balance transfer one credit card I, I actually was going to send the total amount our in anyway long story short is they said call before 10 o'clock so that we can amend the transaction or amend the payment to this other credit card so i called before 10 o'clock they couldn't do it they could only cancel it but my payment for the other credit card is coming out tomorrow right so i said well hang on a minute why don't we just pay the whole amount into this other credit card and there's going to be a credit and then i can call the other Credit card, or credit card up and say, can you put the money back now? I said, just out of curiosity, would you be able to, as Virgin, would you charge for this kind of transaction? They said, no. Well, I thought, well, okay. Well, in that case, Halifax, the credit card company, would not charge either. He said, oh, I'm sorry, sir. I've just done it. I've just cancelled it. I'm like, what is the point of talking to you when you just action things straight away which you cannot undo which costs money because that's just cost me money now you know it's so annoying and i said look hayden that's his name I said hayden you've got to when something's permanent you've got to say are you sure are you sure he did it oh, anyway so stupid dealing with these people it's so annoying but it's cost me money Dickhead. I, this morning's all about me moaning about money. So Halifax just screwed me over. So now it's cost me a hundred pounds with Halifax. And I've got to tell you this little story now. So I've been taken, um, I was with a company called Talk Talk. And in the UK, Talk Talk is a massive company which provides telephone um, stuff, like landlines and mobile phones and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, at the beginning of the COVID, I sent them a message and I said, I'd like to cancel. So I sent them an email after calling up because there was nobody there. So I sent them an email and I said, I would like to cancel. So I sent the email and then I thought it'd been canceled. You know, I wrote a nice letter. I kept a, co kept a copy of it, kept a copy of the email. Subsequently, it's been passed on to two companies and the last one was, was received is BW Legal. And they're asking for 182 pounds because Talk Talk didn't bother reading the email or cancelling it. And what they're saying is, they're saying that according to Talk Talk, I need to have confirmation of cancellation, which kind of makes sense in a way. But then what's the point in sending through a, a cancellation email when you think it should just go through? All right, and it gets a bit deeper than this because as soon as I was notified with Talk Talk and they said that it hasn't been cancelled, I thought, okay, shit, I didn't know this. Right, but you have to get confirmation of cancellation, even though I've got proof that I cancelled it. So I spoke to them, they passed me on to another department where I sent all the information again, right? All the information again. And they didn't do it. So now I'm left in a predicament where this company called J JB, is it? Hang on, I'll tell you who it is. BW Legal have said, okay, if you don't get back to us, by the 22nd of this month, which is in two days time, we'll go ahead and we'll start bumping up the price and start collections. And I said, but I've got back to you now because I sent an email, like lots of emails explain all of this. And I sent an email and they sent an email out to the wrong email address. Okay, the wrong email address. And I said, I need time, send it through again so I can respond. They said we're still going to take the money. I was like, well, what's the point in writing it in the letter to say if you don't contact us by the 22nd, that they will, you know, they will start collections. Well, they're going to start collections anyway. And the guy on the phone was an asshole. Let me just tell you something. Please don't use Talk Talk. Do not use this company. I was, I've had so much hassle with them. 
And now, because I did everything what I truly believed was right, call up, send an email to cancel, I am now being charged 180 odd pounds with lots of correspondence in between. It's a nightmare, I hate it. And I've just said to Daniel, let's just pay it. I'm scared, by the way, do you wanna know how much I've got in my bank account at the moment? Seven pounds, seven. What am I gonna do with seven pounds, you know? <sighs> anyway, let's breathe, John. I'm your holiday, go go, I'm your holiday, go on, I'm your holiday, go on, I'm your holiday. Ooh, this looks nice, Daniel. It was a good looking cow. Not as good looking as you, baby. <laughs> no, you're the cow. You're a twat. <sighs> you know, all the finances are kind of done now. I feel like I think they're not done, you know. I'm, we've, we're sorting through them and Daniel's having a nightmare with PayPal trying to do the accounts. And then this one, can't stand. Honestly, you stink. You stink like farts all the time. It's actually quite disturbing. Why? Do you realize that I've cooked for you every day? <laughs> but that's because you're such a wonderful boyfriend. Well, I'm not though. Why not? Because everybody knows that I'm not. <laughs> that's why you seem to tell everybody. Well, sometimes you're not, but you have been good recently Daniel was so tired so we went to bed and I say Daniel was tired but I was truly tired as well but when Daniel hits the sack he sleeps straight away I do not so I like watch YouTube videos listen to audiobooks podcasts anything like that so how does that help my sleep it does not well he did sleep for an hour so he got back up and we've got like got another two hours to do so we're working a little bit later than usual oh no 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 my god you Sonny was like licking the shite coming out of the dog's arse. Don't do that, Sonny. That's disgusting. <laughs> Come on. Daniel, where am I going tomorrow? He is going to have a dick enlargement. I'm actually going to get a dick reduction because I've been <laughs> having complaints recently. From the dog. Well, I said to get different. You know, um, so I'm going to go for the consultation for my droopy eyelids. Oh, by the way, I didn't, did you want that? Oh, were you there? So I said to the guy, I said, um, I said, when you remove my eyelids, I said, can you put them on the end of my foreskin so I can wink at people? <laughs> so funny, I thought it was quite funny. Anyway, that's how you have to speak to the surgeons By in the, the way, United uh, Kingdom. The, the dog shot in, the, in their bed, so we are lucky. What do you mean? She's she sat in the bedroom. Shat in the bedroom four times. Pooed. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, because Sonny pooed twice here. He's got a bad tummy. I think it's because I don't clean poo. He nearly vomited today. It's the end of the week, and I've got to say thank you so much for watching this video right until the end. If you manage to get this far, that and is. listening to him because he's complaining because he never stopped moaning. Today I've been really oh complaining. God. You know, it's just like a little financial it's a crap. Bad, it's a bad day. Yeah, a bad day. Very fine. I've got the heated blanket on underneath here. I've got my beautiful boyfriend wearing his coat because we can't afford to put heating on. Stop saying that. I just came from outside. Stop it. <laughs> I'll see you next week on Thursday at 6.30. Good night. Bye.